Hello friends, welcome again and this is my new project Tiffin Ordering System and uh, I have developed this project in PHP and MySQL the version for the PHP I am using is the PHP version 7 and the MySQL version is 5.6 also I am running this project on the JAMP server so if you have the WAMP server then you can also run this project and configure this project on the WAMP server also also if you are using the Ubuntu or the Linux operating system then you can also configure that project on the Ubuntu or Linux operating system as well as if you are using the Mac then you can easily configure this project on the Mac also for that you need MAP server for that right so this is all about the server technology and the operating system for front end I am using the HTML CSS and JavaScript and some of the jQuery library for giving some good effect like creating of the sliders integration of the data plugins creating the form validations I am using the jQuery plugins right the front end design has been made in, in uh, HTML, CSS and JavaScript. So this is all about the technology which I have used in this project Tiffin Ordering System. Let's start with the functionality. So the project title is Tiffin Ordering System and uh, this is a mini project which has only and only customer functionality. There is no admin functionality available in this project it means only customer functionality is available. Okay, customer can see the difference, customer can book the orders and customer can make the payment online. Right, this, I have integrated a dummy payment gateway without real transactions okay so let's start with the functionality so you can see this is the home page of the project and all of the products these products are coming from the database and these thalis are these tiffins are coming from the database right so currently i have added 10 so if you want to add more then you can add directly into the database this is the about project from where you will be able to see about the project if you want to change the content then you can change it also this is all tiffin foods means all of the options which is available for the tiffins you will be able to see here right all categories means what you want to choose means you are looking for the breakfast or you are looking for the lunch so if you click on the product means a category you will be the uh, tiffin you will be filtered out according to that right this is all types means what types of things you want to order for veg, salt, kinder, non veg so if you click on the types then you will be able to uh, find out the types there right means that foods there right this is the login from where you will be able to log in and order the details this is the registration from where a customer will be able to register and a customer will be able to log in from that user id and password right this is the contact us page and uh, this is a static page and i am not saving the data of this contact us page anywhere into the database also i am not sending any type of email and sms from this page right so let's start and going i am ordering some other tiffins so this one idli add to cart right so one more there is a restriction inside the project means if you uh, are not logging inside the system then you will not be able to add to the cart <coughs> system right so let me show you so this is idli add to cart so uh, there are a lot of items already available i am going to delete some all items right so i have deleted all of the items now i am going to order the buff this idly add to cart right so currently there are one items and quantity is one right so all different foods so now this is a piaj paratha add to cart so there are two items which i want to order right place order once you click on the place order then the total amount you have to pay is for 30 rupees you don't need to enter the uh, proper card details here because I am not uh, making any type of external transactions right so no need to enter the real uh, real card details here right and total amount you are going to pay is 430 this is non editable and you will not be able to edit the details here right once you click on the make payment then you will get the order confirmation okay this idea come on. this is a confirmation of your order number this and the total on this amount and total you have paid 450 rupees then you have booked your different service right so <coughs> this is the full flow right this is a dashboard so from where uh, customer can see all food items all categories the so same menus is also available here also this is the my order section from where customer will be able to see all of the account details so there is this is a data table and if there are more than 10 records then you can see the pagination here right also if you want to see all of the records then you will be able to set the pagination here also you can filter out the data from here suppose right so 
also you will be able to see the details of the product so this is the order details page and the my order space this is a my account page from where you will be able to update your account details and the change password from where you will be able to change your password and the logout functionality once you log out then above administration will not be displayed right so let me show you so you can see there is no logout there is no my account there is no registration so there is no my order section right but if you log inside the system then above menu is different right so this is all about my project if in order and system and i have developed this project in php and mysql as i told you earlier this is a mini project with customer functionality only so if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment i will incorporate those changes inside this project and i will make this project more better and better according to requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest video updates on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much